Hey, last year, hey, I'm Quan Tracy Cherry, and this is week two, Mentors, Pillar Two. And this is one of the spiritual weeks that connects to week six, listening, and then week 10, resources. And spirit represents our ability to connect to something higher. So when you think about music or when you feel music, how does it connect you to something outside of yourself? You know, those anthems, you know. The, I mean, I was just reading a blog about uh, the Francis Scott Key Bridge in Baltimore was hit by a boat and they're looking for search and rescue for folk. And, you know, he was the one who wrote the Star Spangled Banner. So we all have some connection to music. And just pause taking a deep breath and just imagine as you clear your mind what songs play in the background of your life if your life were a soundtrack right now i have whatever we imagine by james ingram playing and that connects us back to the fall of 2023 when um, belief is not required i recorded a video and wrote a blog for each of the 12 pillars using one of James Ingram's tune. And the first one was this one. Uh, so you can go back to belief is not required and we'll link it up. Uh, but how deep is your love is one of the questions. And that's from one to hundred, how important is music in your life? Then there's word up on our raw material workshop. And we suggest that you do a lyrics Bible. You know, how important are lyrics, the philosophies of certain songs, you know? Uh, even if you have, like, YouTube music, they'll rate, you know, that these are more love songs you played in 2022 and 2023 versus, you know, workout tunes or what have you. And then last and certainly not least is a Beatles favorite that Shaka covered, uh, We Can Work It Out. So with a little love, we can work it out. So how does music, the relational aspect of music play? Now, as promised, we have a far side every week, and this is the one that I just spontaneously or allegedly randomly chose me, or I chose. And there you go. So Taurus, pillar two in Astro Aria, uh, not only connects to music, but Taurus is an earth sign. And it rules the throat. So there is a connection to melody and harmonies created by the throat. But as an earth sign, we pick up earthworms <laughs> serving others. So music or this uh, symbolism as a collective experience. <laughs> hey, you don't like my, I heard you don't like my dirt. Oh, there's so many ways to go with that. So just uh, how deep is your love? Word up. And with a little love, we can work it out. So this is Quan and Tavish with our raw material uh, making you wish or hoping that you wish that this is a good week with the pillar of music that happens to correspond with Holy Week as well. Thanks for listening.